So my FATSO is here. It's on insert one on the liaison. I have inserted bus A of the liaison on the piano. I'm going to turn it on here. So doing this, as you'll see in the liaison video, if you've looked at it, basically what I'm doing right now by pressing this button, I'm inserting the FATSO onto the piano. So let's play the piano and check it out. Turn it on, goes away. I'm going to raise the input, raise the output. I tend to like the bus compressor on the fat, so it's gentle, it's out of the way, it can be transparent. You can take two, three, four dBs and not hear it, which I don't want to hear it here. I just want to do a little bit of crowd control and then a little bit of the warmth. The warmth is really a high frequency limiter. So when the piano gets pingy, the warmth will kick in. Let's listen to how that sounds. That's a perfect example. Check it out. When it goes bum 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 bum, I had to turn around. This is without. See how it gets a little brighter, a little more in your face. If I have the fatso on, it sounds like this. Check this out. Those block chords, listen to the attack of the block chords, listen to the bottom on the block chords, listen to the steadiness of the sound. I'm going to start without again, memorize that sound, and then I'll play it with. Let me line up right on the chords so that you get that right away. Here we go. Without. It's very subtle. I hear a little bit of softening of the transients, the eh, aggressive part, and a little more compact of a sound. And that's what I'm looking for. No pumping, no compression, just a more compact sound. Without. That's a good first step. In the context of the whole thing, it sounds like this. It actually helps integrating the piano a little more with the other two instruments.